Hi, I'm Jared Chester, part of the Bex PFR team at our London, Ohio site, and today just wanted to share a tip that we found to help if your corn crop's actually crusted in. Uh, had some calls, guys concerned that their fields have developed a crust before those plants have fully emerged, and what can they do to help alleviate or fix that problem? One of the best things that we found is actually running that corn planter right back over those planted rows if you've got a crust developed. How we do that is actually uh, walking through the planter. We'll raise our row cleaners all the way up, um, we'll actually grab our T-handle in our depth setting. We normally plant at two inches. We'll actually move that T-handle up and we'll actually target a half inch depth. Now I've had some plots that have actually developed such a hard thick crust I've actually targeted three quarters of an inch, but half inch depth is pretty good rule of thumb. The next adjustment we make is actually back here on our closing wheels. We run spike twister closing wheel standard. And what we do is we basically grab that T-handle, take all the pressure off our closing wheels, just kind of let them float. The third setting or the fourth setting actually with your planter is you want to make sure that you keep enough down force to actually make sure that we're consistently running those disc openers through the ground, especially if that crust is really hard. So make sure that you've got adequate down force to keep the row unit in the ground at that desired half to three quarters of an inch deep. The other big question I hear from farmers and a lot of concern is, you know, Jared, I've got some plants that haven't emerged, some that actually have fully emerged and maybe have one to two leaves up out of the ground and then some that are really ha right there struggling to get through the crust. Is this still a good option, especially with those plants that have emerged? In our past experiences, in my opinion, it's the best option. Way superior compared to a rotary hoe in terms of, uh, in terms of the consistency of the job it does. In terms of those plants that are already emerged, uh, you will cut some leaves, maybe even mangle some plants, but the good thing to, to remember and keep in mind is the growing point on those corn plants are actually still underground until V4. So though, although we may see some cosmetic damage and some cut leaves, we're not, not actually gonna kill those plants. So uh, if you're worried about crusting, the other thing I share with, uh, with farmers is be proactive. If you're thinking that, oh man, this crust is starting to develop, but they're talking rain, you're way better off to be proactive and run that corn planter rather than hoping on that rain that may or may not come. So hopefully these tips help you if you're worried about a crust or battling that right now. If you've got any questions, please reach out to your local BEX representative. Thanks and have a great day.